Animals twin, Justin Turner. Justin, you are just killing it this season, batting 370, by far the highest average in Major League Baseball. What, what have you been doing different? What, what, is, what light bulb has gone off for you this season? Uh, yeah, I think, um, you know, kind of trying to do the same stuff that I've been doing the last few years, and, and that's just being able to repeat my swing and, and trying to take a quality of bat every time, not worry about uh, the results so much. And, uh, you know, this year I've just hit a few more balls that are finding holes where uh, last year I probably lined out a few more times. So uh, results are, are definitely better, but uh, we still got a long way to go, and there's still a lot of work ahead of me. Uh, not only is everything working for you, it's working for your team. 30 and 4 over your last 34. Do you know that the Dodgers are the first team to win 30 games in a 34 game span since the 1977 Royals? When you hear that, what do you think? Uh, I think it's uh, pretty cool. You know, we got a great group of guys, um, and a lot of talent over here, and I uh, just have to tip our cap to the front office for everything they've done, all the all the roster depth they've created, and. It seems like anytime something happens and someone gets called up, uh, we don't miss a beat. They step right in and uh, have a huge impact on this team. And uh, the pitching's been great all year. Uh, bullpen's been outstanding again this year, just like they were last year. And uh, I think if you look at the lineup, uh, you know, one through eight, doesn't matter who it is, we're getting production up and down from the top and bottom. And when you have a different guy playing a hero uh, every single night, uh, it, it's a good recipe to win a lot of games. And I imagine it was a lot of fun for you of uh, being an all-star for the first time. What was that experience like? Yeah, it was uh, it was a whirlwind. You know, the whole week leading up to it uh, with the whole final vote thing, getting voted in uh, was overwhelming and uh, can't believe the amount of support I got from Dodger fans uh, all over the world and also the Kansas City Royal fans who, who we teamed up with uh, to help get Moose in as well. And uh, then when you get there and, and you're surrounded by, uh, you know, the best players in the world, uh, you just kind of look around and you're in awe. So it was uh, definitely something special, something I'll never forget. And, and uh, you know, even though it was a final vote to, to get in there, uh, it's something that, you know, I didn't take for granted and uh, will be special to me for the rest of my life. I saw a headline today, Justin. I think it was in the Washington Post that uh, you guys, the Dodgers, are becoming the Golden State Warriors of Major League Baseball. What do you think about that comparison? Do you feel something special in the works here? Uh, I definitely think we have a, a special team. I don't know if, uh, if I would quite compare us to the Warriors. We haven't accomplished anything yet other than, you know, getting to the playoffs the last four years. But, uh, you know, definitely have a special group here, a lot of talent. Um, I think, I uh, don't know if anything's gonna happen at the deadline or anything. Uh, if they have any plans for that. But uh, even if nothing does happen, you know, we like our club. We like where we're at. Obviously, we're playing good baseball. And, uh, you know, ooh, the Warriors, man, that's, that's a <laughs> tough comparison right now. Well, you guys do have <laughs> Hopefully a in three years you're, you're making the same comparison. Yeah, right. <laughs> right. Well, you guys do have a 10-and-a-half game lead. So, uh, game yeah. Winning streak. I mean, yeah, I would say domination is kind of in your forte right now. But thank that you. beard's dominating. Yes, that beard is definitely <laughs> dominating. But uh, anyway, thank you so much, uh, Justin, for joining us, and good luck the rest of the season.